Hey guys, quick biochemistry basics here. Let's talk about cofactors and coenzymes. Some enzymes need non-protein components to carry out the biological reaction. These non-protein components are called cofactors. An enzyme along with its cofactor is called holoenzyme. If such enzyme loses its cofactor, then it's called epoenzyme. Epoenzyme is usually inactive and requires the cofactor for its function. For example, DNA polymerase requires magnesium ions for its function. The DNA polymerase along with magnesium ions is called a holoenzyme, while the DNA polymerase without magnesium ions is called epoenzyme. Same is true for RNA polymerase. The RNA polymerase requires sigma factor for its function. The RNA polymerase along with the sigma factor is called holoenzyme, while the RNA polymerase without the sigma factor is called apoenzyme. The cofactor can either be inorganic or organic molecules. The inorganic cofactors are usually metal ions that are required for its activity. For example, the enzyme carbonic anhydrase uses zinc ion as a cofactor at its active site. The organic cofactors can either be tightly bound with an enzyme or released free after the reaction is complete. The tightly bound organic cofactor is called prosthetic group, whereas the organic cofactor that is released after catalysis is called coenzyme. Most of the coenzymes cannot be synthesized by the body and are derived from vitamins. The example of coenzymes includes NADH, NADP, FAD, etc.